All right, I'm gonna show you guys basic operation of an AMF 8270 pin spotter. We'll start back here with my mechanic control box. Got a master breaker here. Got a pit motor switch, sweet motor switch, and a table motor switch. Ball stepper for first or second ball, cycle, sweep run, sweep reverse, and we got an on off switch for the mechanic back here. Working off the electrical, you got your back end motor here which runs everything the back end, the spinning pinwheel, that big orange thing you see brings the pins up. You got your distributor here which puts the pins in their places for next ball. You got your pit carpet down there. That big green belt you see spinning along brings everything from the deck nice to the back, ready to go. And then you got your ball return up there, which are a bunch of belts down there, and your main belt, which will send your ball coming up. Here it comes, up along and back down. Here's your chassis. This is the brains, the operation. This runs all electrical components, computer. Um, we got a sweep motor there, runs a sweep, table motor there, which will run that table, which is a big triangle thing, going down, set pins, your table brings the pins from up top, down onto deck, spots them for you, and your sweep is something you all see bowling, it will sweep the deck of all the dead wood. So on a pins journey, once you roll your ball, the pins are going to go back. The ball's going to hit that cur the cushion there and roll up to the ball return assembly. Pins are going to come back, hit the distributor, and they're going to get set up in these bins up here, waiting to go for next ball. The distributor goes around, makes sure 10 pins are ready to go. When 10 pins get ready to go, final pin which is your nine number nine pin it's gonna get in here and push this little switch let the machine know all right we got ten pins ready to run and uh, once you got ten pins it's ready for a new set of pins the shuttle here which is this right here it actually goes up along and you got these little stoppers here, which don't move over forward. And the pin will drop into the table, ready to spot. But I mentioned the ball hits the cushion. You see the cushion's kind of angled. And what happens, see that little arm there? That's opening up a little door. And the ball's gonna roll in there. And that big belt spinning is going to shoot it off. And you're going to watch this. Here comes the ball. There it goes. That's how it kind of separates it. Your table's here. That goes down to spot pins. And it also has three spot cells, which is that little arm there. And there's another one up in front of it, which pinch together closed like scissors. And they pinch like scissors around the neck of the pin. Lift it up, put it back down. And that's a lot of information going quick, but really you can think of this way. Pin comes back. They go up this wheel here. Up on their journey up top. Pin gets up top. Spots in its little bin up there, waiting for uh, the next time it has to be set. We always have 10 pins up here waiting to go. And when the machine's ready, drop on down, bam, right on the deck, ready for you to bowl. Um, I'll give you guys a little bit of a closer look into the ball return assembly. As you see, we got Belt City back here, running a bunch of stuff. But what you gotta know, Little roller coaster track there. There's two little rubber tracks. You got a belt, and that spins the ball right on up those tracks. 
and then down your ball return assembly underground and back to you. And that is really the basic operation of the AMF pin spotter. Let's see if we get some more action shots before you go. Come down here, we got a league going, so I'm sure there'll be enough going on. As you see, you can load more than 10 pins up here in the bin. I've seen up to 21 pins all up here ready to go. They just stand right on top of each other. And here they go, they're going to drop down. And now there's your seat. Got some pins on the desk, ready to go. And that is how your pins come back here, get set up the next time for the ball. Your ball goes back, and to keep you guys enjoying your time up front.